At the end of the second dream, every Warframe player across the world experienced what I would consider and say is a breathtaking cinematic display. A display that no one outside of DE ever imagined or knew about. This is one of those things that is very, very important to a lot of us players in the game as it actually reminded us of how far we have come and how long we have journeyed in this game and with this game since its release from the beta state. Now, regardless of where you might have stood or where you stand right now as far as your perspective of the game and how you feel about the game and the developers, we have to understand and we can all confirm that this moment in the game actually took our breath away. Hello everyone, it's DA here. Hope you guys are doing great. Hope you are doing amazing today. Now when Warframe launched years ago, we heard the voice of Lotus. Now regardless of how bland and how plain and how terrible it could have been for some of us back then, the only one reason that a lot of us had or maybe a few of us had back then was to actually be able to meet this character model in the game and actually go and run on some missions with her. Now, even though 100% of that desire and dream was not completely met, however, at the end of a second dream, the feat was actually being put and played in the game because DE was actually able to do some of these things in the game. They were able to give us a 3D modeling, a working character, and a working display and show of art as far as us being able to encounter and have an interaction with Lotus in the game. Her physical introduction was very, very well planned. It was well integrated into the storyline, well displayed. Her design was also beyond flawless, and I must say, the voice was also excellent as DE's Rebecca Ford did an excellent job as far as the voicing and the action and the interaction is concerned. But like every other person on earth, satisfaction actually has to be met with a greater feeling. And yet after, I actually still desire more as far as what we have to know or what we want to know about Lotus herself and what other secrets she is keeping or could be keeping within the game as far as lore of the game is also concerned. Now, during Death Stream prior to the second dream, an image was actually displayed and showed to us to serve as a concept art for Lotus. Now, in this image, it actually showed her in all her might as she sat at the very center of her lair. Now, I don't know how long before DE will be able to introduce this into the quest because I would love to venture within inside into the lair of Lotus herself. I would love to see a gigantic structure or a gigantic space in the game that is actually also covered to see what her network of operations are looking like. And maybe with the introduction of Umbra, we might actually get something from there. Or maybe the next time we see Stalker, we might be able to acquire more information as far as what Lotus is hiding. But for me personally, I would love to see how Lotus functions, how she works, or even in some cases be able to see her in action as far as what abilities she possesses and what powers that she has. Because as a lot of us know, as the game is concerned, Lotus is actually a sentient. So I would love to see what abilities she possesses. We've actually seen some of the sentients in action. However, I would love to see Lotus in action as far as fighting off danger and actually protecting us. Now, let me know how you feel and what you think about this, because of course my curiosity and my desire is only for scientific purposes. I am not looking for anything other than to be able to enjoy the game, but let me know down below what you feel and how you think about this as far as being able to encounter Lotus once again in the game and be able to go on and journey and have some battles with her side by side. Let me know down below in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a thumbs up and also subscribe for more. As always, it is DS signing out. I'll see you in the next one. The Meru will be your focus, but we have so much more to do. Here in the Orbiter, transference will be even stronger. Command the Warframes. Make whole the shattered world you've been given. Are you ready, Tenno? Yes, Lotus, I am.